Welcome to Handsave Tribe Adventure Chanel. Please do not forget to subscribe to my Chanel if you haven't yet. And please leave your comment. Today we're going to learn how the Hadsave make bows. About 400 of the more than 1,200 Hadza people living in Tanzania still subsist entirely on traditional means of foraging, but the construction and use of bow and arrow technology remains an important daily ritual for most Hadza hunters. Hadza bow ayers construct powerful bows from local materials and use them to hunt a wide variety of prey. Over 95% of Hadza men possess a bow, and hunters use their bows to provide the majority of the meat in their diet and therefore represent a vital aspect of the Hadza economy. Hadza men begin using bows at a very early age. Boys as young as three years old mimic the manufacturing behaviors of their elders and begin manufacturing their own bows. Yeah, 
Ndio maana kama hujui kuuza kitu usije kaingia kwa watu.